Okay. And let's see. To load tables, we need to click on select button. Now we'll see. In categories table, there is no year, quarter, month, week type of fields. In customer, we don't know such type of fields. There is no year, quarter, month type of fields. No table is representing time dimension, but I have to analyze business based on year, the year wise, customer wise, year wise sales. Okay, I want to perform this year sales and last year sales like this. We need to perform, we need to analyze business based on year, quarter, month like that. So, based on existing data in others table, here we have order date. By using this order date, we need to calculate new time dimension table. A load orders table and now there's orders. By default also it will take orders only. Next we need to sort orders table in the ascending order of order date. Resident orders order by order date. Example order sort. After sorting, minimum order date will be in the first record and the maximum order date will be in the last record. Here to avoid automatic concatenation, I'll give no concatenate because this is order stable data and this is sorted data. Duplication will be there because these two will be same set of fields. Okay. Now in order sort table we have sorted data. Okay. After sorting, we need to extract minimum date and maximum date and we need to keep in a variable. To create variables, we need to use let. Let v min date equal to p com. P function contains three arguments. First one is field name. Here field name is order date. Next one is position 0. And next one is Table name, table name orders are not orders, here orders are based on sorted data. First record means 0th position. Okay. Next one is let v max date p com. Field name. Order date, then position minus one. Order sort, table name. Okay. Now, by use to make it easy in calculations, I'll convert this v min date and max min date number format. To convert dates into numbers, we need to use num function. To make it easy in calculations, I'm converting these dates into numbers. No. Okay. Now we need to create a new table, some temp table by using this p min date and max date. Temp table name. Now see, first see the code load 
dollar of we need to access variables within dollar of symbol dollar of b min date plus and record number minus one previously here we have converted data into numbers by using num function now we will convert we need to convert this number into date format for the purpose here we need to use date function date of as template okay while creating new table we need to specify a number of records how many records the table must contain for example so to specify number of records here we need to use auto generate function for example if you give auto generate 1000 it will generate 1000 records auto generate 500 it will generate 500 records like that so here instead of giving 1550 like that i am giving dynamically say b max date minus v min date plus 1 now by using this template field we can create actual time dimension table time dimension load like template as order date because all these dates are order dates only template as order dates then we need to apply date functions year of template as year year and month of template as month month and week of template as week week day of template as day day of template as day and we are using this template from already existing table if you want to use fields from already existing table we need to perform resident resident table name temp after calculating time dimension table we don't need this temp table drop table table name temp here after calculating v min date and v max date we don't need this order sort table we have order table already so I need to drop this order sort table. Drop table order sort. This one. Now click on reload. I'll add fields. Select fields. And add day. month order date week and year okay layout rearrange sheet of this say order dates here sir from 2005 to 2010 month month jan to december weeks days okay now if you go to table here that will be like this in addition to as we have already ordered table actually we have, we have created one more table time dimension table now we can analyze business based on year month week day like that okay now here we don't have we didn't calculate quarter right here we don't have quarter function directly see here we don't have quarter function directly so based on month we need to calculate quarter how can we write this one is month of template by 3 for this one I think we need to apply seal function seal of month of template by 3 as month 
as month. Not month, quarter this one. As quarter. Click on reload. I'll add this quarter field. Okay. See, four quarters. One, two, three, four. Instead of this one, I want to display Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. Simply we need to append Q before that expression. Within single quotes, Q. In click Q, concatenation operator is ampersand. Ampersand is the concatenation operator. Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. And here it is displaying month in Jan, Feb, March format. I want to display number format, 1 to 12. Simply for month of template, we need to apply num, num of month of template. Same. One, two, four. Now we can analyze business based on a year, based on month, week, day, quarter, month number like that. This way we can calculate time dimension. Rate. 